The myopectineal orifice is situated between the inguinal ligament in front and the superior ramus of the pubis behind, which I can actually feel with my forceps. So it's through that wide window, the myopectineal orifice, that the femoral artery, the femoral vein, and the femoral nerve cross over into the thigh from the abdominopelvic cavity. As soon as they enter the thigh, below the inguinal ligament, they find themselves in a very interesting intermuscular area, which we call the femoral triangle, because it lies within a triangular outline. A couple of very interesting things about the femoral triangle. Firstly, it's not where most people think it is. It's not, for instance, smack bang in the front of the thigh. It's rather awkwardly situated. It's on the anteromedial aspect of the very proximal end of the thigh. Which is why, in order to display things in the femoral triangle adequately, it is necessary to position the subject in a particular way. The thigh needs to be abducted significantly, and externally rotated, and perhaps even slightly flexed. Only then do you get a proper view of the femoral triangle.